Hey everyone, I'm here with my Deep Fluff Strawberry Shaving Soap Review. Um, I've been using it here and there. It's actually not something that I reach for all of the time. As you can see, it is a foamy kind of whipped texture. It is strawberry inspired and for that being basically the premise that they built it around, that is not like the initial scent that I get. I do kind of get like a lotion-y, there might be some strawberries in there, but it isn't a significant part of the scent to me. Um, I do think as you put this on your legs there is a tiny bit of bubble action. It is very slight. Um, they do recommend leaving this on your legs for three to five minutes or something like that so that all of the ingredients can penetrate and facilitate your shaving as well as probably loosen up your follicles for your shaving experience. The reason why I didn't love this product is that it also has claims as far as the moisturizing properties and for me I did not notice any moisture to my legs. So to me that is a miss, that would have been a great benefit. Um, also the fact that it is a whip product, there's not a lot here. This little container was about $10 and I've only used it about three times and you can see that I'm probably about the halfway mark or slightly under so I'm probably going to get about four more uses so seven uses for ten dollars isn't the best price point for a whipped product I should also mention that the scent does not linger and that can sometimes be a pushing point for me whether or not I like an item so it's a fail all around um, as far as moisture, I do prefer the EOS for shaving. I should tell you that the EOS pump is really annoying to me. It should actually be manufactured in a toothpaste tube that you can squeeze it out because the pump is so slow and the product gets stuck in the bottom. Um, and as far as just the regular plain Jane economical route, I would probably suggest the Gillette for women. Um, I will not be repurchasing this. It is probably a fun splurge. Nothing to write home about. Sadly, won't be repurchasing it. For all the things that are at a Lash store, this is not something that I would gravitate towards or repurchase. I hope you like my review, and I'll see you guys next time. Mwah.